Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good morning. Good day. Welcome to the goods. We're so happy to have you here. I'm so happy to be here. Awesome. Now we understand you have a little history with one of us on the couch, and I'm just hoping it's not she here. Uh, unfortunately, <laughs> no. <laughs> no, it's with this little one. Hi, little How one. Are you? <laughs> We grew up together in we Vancouver. Did. We did. Um, we played soccer for how many years? Many years. Ma many years. We were we were in such great shape. We were. <laughs> we were we in our ran a lot. Yeah. We remember, we ran a lot. A lot. Kobe was the goal scorer, so you I just had to like, get it to Kobe, wow. and she would. Yeah. Thank you. She was really Thank good. You. Out of the kindness of my heart, Kobe. Yes. I knew you were coming today, yes. so I wrangled up a high school yearbook photo. Did oh, anyone see that? That's oh, you. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. I want to smile, but not smile too much, but smile a little bit yeah, yeah. those photos. It was, uh, it was an early smile. It was, a, it was, it was. Yeah. Well, thank you for that. Yeah, no. Uh, You're we also, welcome. We also went to summer camp together, um, and here we are I'm looking terrified. like small boys. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> There you are. Let's show us. But here, like, we were not oh. running around being promiscuous teenage girls. I wasn't. No, I was <laughs> very much I was not. A good girl. I would classify us as like nerdy tomboys. We were we were nerdy tomboys, and yeah. we were like sporty. And then I went from sporty to to theater. You did. And did you? Because we didn't go to the same high school. Yeah, no, so. we were both equally sportive yeah. and theater nerds. Yeah. And now that you have two daughters, isn't that kind yeah. of what you want them to grow up to be? Oh, like, I hope they're nerds. Super I'm like, yeah, oh my god, let's be nerds. <laughs> Yeah. Let's be nerds. And you had two twin boys. I, I can't even believe it. Let's like, just hope they're nerds like us. I know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nerds forever. Yeah, nerds forever. forever. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so when you weren't playing soccer or being a nerd with me, yes. you were leaving Vancouver and going to LA for pilot season. I was, yeah. Uh, I, I like to call it like the Canadian migration. And you would go. <laughs> yes. And you would work as a waitress in Vancouver. And then you would earn all your money. And then you'd go and you would audition and try to get a pilot or any kind of work, really. And you did. And you did. And I yeah. did. Yeah. And it, and it paid oh. off. Oh, yes. You did. So, Colby, I gotta ask you. Yes. I gotta ask about how I've met your mother. I've seen sure. every episode twice. Oh my God, that's a lot of read. your life. I'm I don't so read. sorry. No, it's been. I, I gotta ask you. How yes. many times per day do people call you Robin or Sherbosky in real life? Other than like my husband. Or, <laughs> um, <laughs> I don't really get called Robin very much, but I think like Robin Sparkles is a bit of a Canadian mascot. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Canadian Absolutely. You know, every time it's Canada Day, there's just like me <laughs> in a weird <laughs> outfit, like Bye. in front of a Canadian flag, which I love. Which yeah. I yeah, which yeah, I yeah. which yeah. I do love. Yeah. I do. So, yeah. Now, yeah. What, what, uh, what's your yes. biggest challenge going from uh, from sitcoms to film? It was it was more um, I wanted to try different things. I was lucky enough to be on How I Met Your Mother for nine years. Wow, that's And crazy. having that kind of consistency in this industry, as I'm sure some of you guys know, it's like, it's, it's insane. It's insane. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, so I, I love that, but when the show was done, I just wanted to switch it up. And, uh, and I, I've been very lucky to do, you know, uh, bigger films like all the Avengers stuff, but also yeah. smaller independent films. And um, it was, it was okay. It was, it, it, it takes a little bit more out of your family life because sure. the usually intensity. you're, yeah. the intensity yeah. and you're traveling a lot. Yeah. Usually things don't shoot where you work. And sure. so that was a yeah. new thing to adjust to. Yeah, yeah. Um, but, but overall it's been pretty amazing. Well, I guess it's yeah. so. amazing. Yeah, yeah. Um, now, I don't know if they told you, but we like uh, gossip here at the <laughs> so I'm just uh, one hot uh, goss. What's the hot goss, guys? Well, we're, com we're coming us. to you. We're oh my God. Yeah. Yeah. I, like, yeah. I got nothing but cold goss over here. We want the hot goss. Any like back, you know, behind the scenes on set little oh stories you can share God. with us? Oh my God. We won't tell anybody. We oh promise. Oh gracious. Um, um, Okay. <laughs> I want a Tom Cruise story. Do oh, you... Tommy. Uh, yes, I call him Tommy. Tommy. Oh, Tommy. Oh, Tommy. 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 I already oh, shot him just now. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yes, I, I shot a movie with Tom uh, two years ago now uh, called Jack Reacher Never Go Back, and it was like this crazy action movie, and it was awesome, and it was so intense. <laughs> I mean, we trained for like two months solid, and it was, wow. uh, I was, I was looking pretty good. I was pretty ripped. Yeah. You were and, almost uh, as in shape as you were yes. when we were 14. <laughs> yeah, almost, almost. Yeah. The, the, the fun thing I can, I can say about Tom is that, and it's, it's nearing that time of year where every year Tom gifts this coconut white chocolate cake. And he I've sends out 
It's oh, it, it's no. what? I've heard. And about he that. sends out like hundreds, potentially wow. thousands really? of cakes to like all you know all these people that he's worked with, all the people that he knows and loves. And I've gone at the last two years now. Every I year you get the same cake. In a while. Every year the same cake. Mm. So I'm really maybe if he sees it. He's definitely watching. But yeah. I am right. Ask him right now. Yeah, I have never highly anticipated something as much as this <gasps> cake. Like I'm literally recipe. like wow. every day I'm I'm. Is there a delivery at the door? Is it like? <laughs> is it? Is it here? Is it here? And it hasn't come yet. But um, it could so still. To get it us could that still recipe. Yes. We oh, do a segment yeah. called yeah. "Get That Recipe," where Shahir gets recipes for us. Can you call Tom Cruise, please? <laughs> please. Or Tommy. Do we want to get that recipe? Tommy. 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 Tom. 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 Uh, Tom, Tom. Uh, it's made by. I know that it's made by a woman in Los Angeles, and this is like the Super one helpful. job she has. We'll leave it with you. We'll leave it with you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. made yeah. by someone in LA. Go. Go. Now, Kobe, we have Mastercard to thank for you being here, and you partnered up on a video series with them, right? Yes, I have. Have. Uh, basically, when you're buying anything online, um, when you check out, you're going to see a MasterPass button, and you're able to suppress that, and it already has all of your stored shipping information, your credit oh, wow. card information, and it's super safe and very easy to do. Um, so yeah, I've partnered with them to sort of bring some awareness to it, and we were I was lucky enough to shoot these really fun sketches. Um, some really real, and then some yeah, yeah. a little bit, a bit more comedic. But it's basically about, um, you know, Masterpass saves you a lot of time. Very cool. And uh, and these are these are um, examples of how I would spend that time. And, and some of them are really hilarious. We have yes. a clip. Let's let's take a look. My Canadian she shed. Some gravy on it. Feels like home. What are you doing? Rep, are you blind? Hit him! Hit him! Hit him! Hit him! Hit him! Gravy on tap. Gravy on tap. It was funny hearing the audience because they were really into the poutine, and then I think I did one too many strokes of gravy, and they're like, no, 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 too much, too much, yeah. too much. Yeah. No, but it was really fun, and they were, we came up with such ridiculous ideas, and they allowed me to collaborate, and um, we also hired on this great Canadian writer, Auntie Donahue, so it was really cool. Cool. Oh, hey, nation. More fashion, style, and beauty tips are just a click away, so click subscribe here. Or is it here? Here. Can somebody? Okay, just click here.